Hello and welcome to Sylvan Mist Designs. Thank you so much for joining me. We're doing something a little bit different today with these three herb jars. Now I've painted the mandala on the front of these and a ribbon that ties it all the way around. And then I have oven cured these jars to make sure that the paint is going to be permanent. Now that I've painted these jars, I do want to add a chalkboard label on the back. For tonight's project, you want to make sure to have chalkboard paint, masking tape, scissors, of course, a sponge brush, and a few round multi-use labels. Now this chalkboard paint is pretty thick. Make 100% sure that you shake it very well before use. Although they are oven cured, I wasn't 100% sure if the masking tape would cause any problems to the ribbon on the bottom. So just to be on the safe side, I did include a little piece of paper over the paint before I laid down my masking tape. I'm gonna take my masking tape, measure out a spot just about an inch tall and approximately an inch and a half wide on these jars. When the rectangle has been laid out in masking tape, I've taken the round multi-use stickers, cut them in four pieces, and then used them here in the corners to create just a little bit of a decorative edge. Once we've ensured that the tape and the stickers are down, I'm gonna use just one single layer at this time of the chalkboard paint. You certainly do want to apply a second layer. I did notice once the first layer had dried, there were still spots that were see-through. However, per the bottle's recommendations, you do want to wait a full 24 hours before doing this. I'm repeating this process on all three of the jars. If you're interested in the process of how we got to this point and oven cured these items, take the jars, Place them in a cold oven. When the glasses are in the oven, at that point only, turn it on to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Let your oven preheat. I'm using a toaster oven, so it only takes about 10 minutes. Most take about 20. Once your preheating has completed, mark a timer for 30 minutes. Once your 30 minutes has elapsed, do not be tempted to take them out of the oven. Leave them in the oven until it is completely cool. At this point, take them out again. The process of oven curing will make the paint permanent and top rack dishwasher safe. After this first layer was placed on all three, I did wait the 24 hours, added a second layer, and then waited approximately another 12 hours before removing the tape. Now I did find here the tape, unfortunately, right at the edges still did bleed a bit. So I did have to go back in afterwards and clean that up a bit. To do that, I had just taken just the sharp edge of one of my tools to clean that up. All in all, the project itself took approximately 30 minutes to complete taping them, painting them, then the wait of 24 hours and 12 hours in between both layers and the removal. Not bad for a project like this. If you do decide to try something similar, I would love to see it. Leave your comments below. Thanks again for joining me. I certainly do appreciate it. Take care and have a great day, guys.